Hello, good evening. Hello. Hello there. Hello, teacher. Hi, Wendy. Good evening. How are you? Hello, Hector. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Good evening. How are you? Fine. I'm fine. fine. Nice. I like your background. Me gusta, me gusta su ah. I like your background. I think I know the place. The don, don de ese lugar. Forest. Sorry? Montecristo Forest. Yes. Parque Nacional Montecristo. Yes, I knew it. Ya lo, lo sabía. ¿Dónde he visto ese fondo? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very good. I like it. Okay, Thank hello, Carla. Hello. How are you? Carla Maria. <laughs> Bye. No, oh my, I forget that I have two Carlas in this class. <laughs> All right. Hello, Christina. Hello. How do you feel? Happy? Good? <laughs> How do you feel? ¿Cómo se siente? How do you feel? Um, cansada, ¿cómo se dice? Tired. You say tired. <laughs> tired. Tired. That's right. <laughs> Fire, se dice. Tired, tired. 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 Okay. Tired. Yeah. Hi, Lucy. Hi. How are you? Good, thank you. How are you? I'm very well. Thank you for asking. Okay, we have Maho connected. Hello, Maho. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Fine, thank you, teacher. And you? I'm very well. Thank you for asking. Hi, Santos. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How do you feel today? Yes, I feel I'm good. Relaxed. Are you feel relaxed? relaxed no work right. today. Oh, nice. Good to know. Yes. Uh, Hi, Daniel. Uh, until tomorrow. <laughs> Hello, Daniel. Hi, teacher. How do you feel today? Yes. How do you feel? Happy, good, bad? <laughs> ah, Tired. Good. Good. Excellent. Very good. Nice. Hello, Rafa. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. And you? Uh, yeah, yes, okay. Ah, oh, you're okay. Nice. I, 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 today I'm not, I'm not working, um, but I, I tomorrow for day. Oh, so you work with Santos? You you work tomorrow? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I see. Today right. I, 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 I am here in my I am here in my home sleep. Sleeping every day. <laughs> Sleeping <laughs> every day. <laughs> oh, you slept all day. I like it. But you work at night, right? Trabajo anoche. You work at night yesterday. <laughs> no. Thank you. Yes. Trabajo yeah. anoche. Did you work uh, yesterday night? Yes. Yesterday at night and I'm working. Yeah. Okay. That's why. Okay, very good. Uh, so we are going to start then. Vamos a empezar. We are going to start. Uh, today is the last class of um, today is the last class of unit number two or of week number two de la semana dos. Okay. Uh, espero no sé todos los que están conectados. I don't know if everybody completed uh, the platform work. No sé si todos ya completaron el trabajo de la plataforma. Ya vamos a hablar de los problem de los problemitas que les da a algunos. Okay. Yeah. Todos completaron? Did everybody work on the activities? Yes. yes. Very good. Uh, I'll check in a moment, yes. okay? Voy a revisar en un momento. Um, ese día haremos, eh, haremos sesiones de grupos o salas de grupos, okay? Solo que, eh, para que para evitar el problema que tenemos, porque el problema me lo da cuando cambio de grupo, okay? A mí me interesa que interactúen entre ustedes, 
¿ok? I, I, I really care about that. Realmente me interesa mucho, me importa mucho eso. Así que les voy a explicar bien la actividad antes de que vayamos a sesiones de grupos. Y en el grupo que entre, ahí en ese grupo me, me voy a quedar, ¿ok? No me voy a mover de grupo, no voy a andar así como siempre visitando los diferentes, los diferentes grupos, ¿ok? Le voy a dar un tiempo estimado y después de ese tiempo lo voy a sacar, pero me voy a quedar en el mismo grupo para no andar de grupo en grupo porque ahí es que se... Se, se traba, ¿ok? Ahí es que se traba y, y ahí es que se pierde el tiempo, ¿de acuerdo? Pero ahí van a estar trabajando en equipos ustedes, por supuesto, ¿right? Y si no funciona, pues solo vamos a intentar una vez y luego ya no intentamos porque si no les voy a quitar tiempo al final y no quiero eso. And I don't want that. Ok, so let's start with the attendance then. Empecemos con asistencia. Let's start with the attendance. Ok, let me see here. Um, ok, Carlos. Carlos dijo que se iba a conectar más tarde. Yes, yes, it's true. I remember. Thank you. Uh, Claudia, all right. Cristina. Cristina is connected, I think. Me pareció ver conectada a Cristina, ¿verdad? Present. Ah, oh, yeah. Present. Cristina is present. Present. Doris. Present. Okay. All right. Doris. Elenison. Kelsey? Present teacher. All right. Kelsey and... Okay, very good. Uh, Hazel? Teacher. Yeah? No me mencionó a mí. Oh, sorry, Daniel. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Daniel, sorry. Okay, let me see. Hazel? Hector? I'm here, teacher. All right, Irma. Irma is connected, right? The microphone, Irma. Javier. It's okay, Irma. I put the attendance. Present teacher. Okay. Javier, ya me completó el trabajo de la plataforma. Eh, sí, teacher. Okay. He tenido unos inconvenientes, pero sí, lo completé ahora. Sí, le, le, le pregunto porque yo sé que no estuvo conectado ayer. ¿Ok? Sí, sí, pero ya, ya lo terminé. Ok, perfecto. Thank you very much. Johnny. Okay. José Mauricio. Lucy. Present. All right. Majo. Presentation. Very good. Rafa. Present teacher. Very nice. Santos. Present teacher. Okay. Ulises. Present teacher. Nice. Wendy. Yes. I am here, teacher. Very good. Jessica. Carla Maria. Present. And Carla Raquel. Present teacher. Very good. De tus Carlas me han salido very punctual. Me han salido bien puntuales las dos Carlas. <ríe> I like that. No solo ella, ¿verdad? Muchos. Pero digo las dos Carlas porque yo sé que tengo dos Carlas. I have two Carlas in the class, all right? Good. Okay. Um, very good. So let's start uh, with the class then. And to, to start with the class, well, I have an activity uh, in pairs. But the problem is that sometimes at the beginning, some other people add to the class, all right? Tengo una actividad de parejas al principio, pero la voy a hacer luego porque yo sé que algunos se van uniendo después y hay que estar viendo cómo se les explica, ¿ok? So we will do it later, ¿ok? So right now, uh, we are going to uh, complete. Let me show you here. Here we have a matching activity, ¿ok? Here we have a matching activity. Tenemos una actividad de matching. Uh, the activity is on page number 27, ¿ok? Page number 27. So we need to match the steps to follow when making an online purchase, all right? The steps to follow when making an online purchase, yeah? So we match these ones with these ones, all right? Yeah, so what do you prefer? To work in pairs or to work alone? ¿Qué prefieren, trabajarlo en parejas o solitos? What do you want? It's a matching activity, okay? Es una actividad de emparejamiento. It's a matching activity. ¿Qué prefieren? Work alone or work in pairs? Work alone or work in pairs? Tell me something. 
working long. Work alone. Forever alone. Whatever. Forever alone. Forever alone. <laughs> you wanna be. All right, so let's do it alone then. So the idea is to match uh, the steps, right? Okay, so let's do the matching. So work alone then. Lo pueden hacer en su libreta, si tienen una libreta. Okay, so work alone. Let's work alone. Trabajemos individualmente entonces. Let's work alone. Teacher, me copia? Yeah, I do. Okay, eh, voy a estar de diente mientras llego a casa. Okay, no problem, it's okay. Gracias. All right. La Gracias. Uh, just, uh, so we need to complete with this information, we need to complete this information, right? Okay, to make the steps. We're making an online okay, purchase. Right? No entiendo, ¿qué lo que vamos a hacer? Okay, we have steps, right? These are some steps to follow when making an online purchase, okay? Paso a seguir cuando se hace una compra en línea, right? So this on, on, on light yellow, on, yeah, on light blue, sorry, and Celestia acá on, on, on light blue, you have part of the steps and, the, and these steps are incomplete. So they need some other information to complete them, all right? Necesitan esta información para completar acá. Credit cards, for example, ¿qué le falta? Credit cards, what? O sea que de lo, de lo orange, eh, tenemos que ponerlo en, es orange es el complemento. That's right, it's, it's the complement of the phrases on the left. El complemento de la frase okay. en la izquierda. For example, credit cards, what can you put for this? Credit cards, what? Information. Information, exactly. So credit cards, information, that is number one. Esa sería la número uno. Credit cards, information, okay? okay? That would be number one. Okay. Credit cards. Okay, Information, right?
uh, please do me a favor. When you finish uh, the activity, go to reactions and raise your hand, okay? Go to reactions and raise your hand when you finish. Para ver quiénes van terminando. Para ver quiénes van terminando, si termina, va a reacciones, reactions, y, le, y levanta la mano. Okay, please. Okay, thank you very much. I can see Santos, Cristina finished, and let me see. And Carla and Lucy too, right? Okay. Thank you very much. Let's wait for the others. Esperemos un momentito más. Let's wait for a little while. Uh, don't lower your hand, please, all right? No bajen la mano, así dejen. Don't lower your hand. Leave it like that. Así dejen la mano, no la bajen. Es para ver quiénes van terminando, okay? It's just to see to the people who have finished. So please don't lower your hands. Okay, uh, well, I think it was enough time, right? So let's take a moment uh, to check uh, the answers, okay? Uh, let's see. So number one, obviously it's credit cards information, right? Credit cards information. The pronunciation is credit cards information. Uh, let's see number two. Uh, let's listen to um, Carla Maria, number two. Don't lower your hands, please. No bajen la mano, don't lower your hands yet. Carla Maria, number two. Can you share, please? Confirm your information uh, to your account. Uh -huh. Confirm your information to your account. Mm, I think, well, what about the others? What do you think? Lo demás que piensan, the others, what do you think? No. Submit. 
Ah, all right. So you have and submit, all right? Yeah, give me a minute. Give me a minute, give me a minute, please. Okay, uh, very good. I'm sorry. Okay, so uh, Santos was saying, confirm your information and submit. All right, so the answer is, confirm your information and submit, all right? And submit. Ahí falta N, all right? So confirm your information and submit. Okay, that would be the answer. Good. Okay, thank you, Carla, and thank you, Santos. So you have to change. Uh, the rest, I think, Carla Maria. Number three, select the items, what? Purchase. Purchase. To purchase, all right. Deme un segundo, por favor. Bye bye. I'm sorry, my kid is looking for something here. I'm sorry, he's gone. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Um, select the items to purchase, you said, right? So it's here. All right. Select the item to, to purchase. Okay, that's excellent. Let's see uh, the next one. Let's listen to uh, Christina. What do you have in go to there? What do you have here, Christina? Only online web service. Online web page. It's correct, Christina. Web online, yeah. online web page. Web it's page. correct. Web page. Okay, go to the online web page. It's excellent. Now let's listen to uh, let's see um, Lucy, right? Right. Um, billing address. It's correct. It's right. The billing. Address. address the billing address is correct thank you very much okay write the billing address okay that's the answer for the next uh now let's listen to let me see here who else is javier check yeah check the the price check the price exactly so here is check the price the price that's excellent check the price very good uh, now let's see the next one. Let's listen to uh, Ulysses. Confirm the method of payment. Of payment, exactly. Confirm the method of payment. payment. That's correct. Confirm the method of payment. And the last one, Santos. Long, long, long to your account. Exactly. Your account. Login to your account. You say login, 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 login to your account. Yeah. Okay. So login to your account. Okay. That's account. perfect. Excellent. So uh, number one is credit, credit cards information. Confirm your information and submit. Select the items to purchase. Go to the online webpage. Write the billing address. Uh, check the price, confirm the method of payment and log in to your account, okay? Yeah, so does everybody have it the same? Así les quedó a los demás? Do you, do you have it the same, everybody? Yeah? Yes, or you yes. changed it, you changed yes. it, I imagine, right? Carla Maria, you changed, I think, right? Yes, I think you changed the, the answers. Okay. Very good. So let's go to the next activity. And in the next activity, uh, this is the next activity. It's in, it's in pairs, okay? It's in groups, sorry. La siguiente actividad es en grupos. It's in groups. So in the next activity, it says, ask different partners valid reasons why customers can ask for a refund and reasons when they cannot ask for it, okay? So first, 
first, before we go to working groups, antes de que vayamos a, a trabajar en equipos, okay? Take a moment and write two acceptable reasons, okay? Why you can ask for a refund, okay? And two unacceptable reasons why you cannot ask for a refund, okay? Let me repeat. Va a escribir dos razones aceptables para pedir un reembolso y dos razones no aceptables para pedir un reembolso, okay? Yeah. So take a moment and write, please. No escriban en el cuadrito. Don't write on the chart. Do it on your notebook. Eso háganlo en su cuaderno. Do it on your notebook, okay, please. Okay? Two and two. Two, accept two acceptable reasons and two unacceptable reasons, okay? For example, I'm just uh, I'm just thinking. Maybe you can say the acceptable reason is because the item is uh, dented, for example, or because um, some parts are missing. Algunas partes fal faltan algunas partes because some parts are missing, or uh, because um, it doesn't work. Porque no funciona because it doesn't work. Okay. Unacceptable reasons. Because uh, I received the item too late. Porque recibí el artículo demasiado tarde. Okay? Maybe. That's an, an unacceptable reason. Okay? So write two and two. Two acceptable reasons and two unacceptable reasons. Okay? On your notebook. Si tienen la fotocopia, no lo hagan en ese cuadrito. Okay? Do it on your notebook, please. Now you can lower your hands. Ya pueden bajar la mano. Now you can lower your hands. Uh, this is on page number 27, okay? This is on page number 27. On page number 27. Eso está en la página 27. Page number 27.
only two acceptable and only two unacceptable reasons, okay? So as a whole, you need to complete four reasons, okay? Four reasons, two acceptable and two unacceptable. Eh, Carla María, ¿me escucha? Yes, can you listen to me? Yes. Eh, no pudo arreglar lo de los ejercicios, ¿verdad? Eh, sí, terminé. Ah, sí, terminó. Ok. Sí. Ok, perfecto. Entonces, les, el problema ya no, ya no es problema. It's not a problem anymore. Eh, lo tenía que copiar en una hoja de Word y de Word pasarlo a, ahí. My goodness. Sí, pregunto porque hay varios que todavía tienen problemas. Entonces... Ya escucharon la solución de Carla María. Sí, como pues no tuve respuesta, ¿verdad? Entonces empecé a sí. buscar tu propia solución. Sí, yo pregunté, yo pregunté de hecho, pero hasta, la, hasta ahorita estoy esperando que me, que me contesten. Pero sí, se la consulta. Sí, entonces eso me funcionó. Ah, ok, entonces gracias Carla, pero hizo lo, lo pegó en Word y ahí hizo el, lo resolvió. O sea, y... Ajá, y de ahí lo volví a pegar ahí. Ah, ok. Thank you very much. Gracias. Entonces, thank you very much. Así que los demás, entonces, podemos aplicar la solución de Carla, porque aún no me han contestado. Ok. Please. Y que creo que, teacher, creo que a varios nos da diferentes errores, porque a mí en unas me aceptaba punto y en otras no. Y de repente sí. si yo le quitaba el punto y ya le daba otra vez, me lo, me lo daba como incorrecto. Tenía que volverlo a escribir. Entonces, Creo que son diferentes problemas. Sí, es que hay tres, según les mostré ayer, perdón, hay tres posibles opciones para cada respuesta. Entonces, tal vez ahí es que se da la, la, la confusión. No, no sé, el sistema quizás ahí confunde la respuesta. No sé, yo no sé mucho de eso, de, 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 de HTML y eso, que cuando hacen eso, ¿verdad? Me imagino. Eh, pero me imagino que ahí tal vez es que les da el problema. Confunde las respuestas el sistema seguramente pero no es porque están mal configuradas, sino que como hay tres, tres posibles respuestas, ahí está el problema, quizás la confusión, pero eso no nos, no nos compete a nosotros como, como maestros. Entonces, sí. vamos a esperar a ver, a ver qué dicen, porque mientras tanto podemos aplicar la solución que, 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 que aplicó Carla, ¿verdad, Carla María? A ver si nos funciona a nosotros mientras nos responden. ¿Okay? Sí, eso sí. Uh -huh. 
Incluso ahí en el grupo, ustedes ya estuvieron mandando los problemas. Y en el grupo de WhatsApp hay personas de, de administrativas también. Hay dos personas administrativas, me imagino que ya vieron también, que, que están teniendo problemas con los ejercicios. En el grupo de WhatsApp que tenemos, ¿ok? Esperemos, así que esperemos que solventen. I hope they solve. All right, are you ready? Are you ready to acceptable and to unacceptable reasons? Are you ready? Estamos listos? Are you ready? Yes, no? Yes. Yes, yes. okay, that's perfect. Okay, now listen, listen carefully, please. Pay attention carefully. Okay, look. For this activity, uh, we will work in groups of four, five, okay? For this activity, we will work in groups of five, okay? So please listen to your classmates, okay? You will work in groups of five. And to complete this chart, you need to practice with four classmates, all right? Imagine I practice with Javier. So I write the name here, okay? Javier, for example, okay? Hold on. This is only one example, right? I write Javier, Javier, Javier. Uh, one, one acceptable reason why customers can ask for a refund? Uh, the wrong size and color. Okay, the wrong size. So I write here, yo escribo acá. The wrong side and color, Javier. One unacceptable reason, Javier? Uh, the loss on invoice. And only one, only one. Only one, only one. Only one. Only one. Only one. Ah, okay. The loss of the, the invoice. Or the, the invoice, see. Okay, very good. So I, I write the loss of the invoice, all right? And then imagine in my group, I also have Lucy Natalia. So uh, Lucy Natalie, sorry. So I write Lucy, escribo Lucy, and I ask her, y le pregunto, Lucy, one acceptable reason, y yo, yo y tomo notas, and I take notes, all right? One unacceptable reason, and I take notes, all right? Yeah. ¿De acuerdo? ¿Se entiende qué van a hacer? Is it clear what you have to do? Yeah. So you listen and you take notes. Listen and take notes. Okay. All right. Let's go then. I read, I read your message, Majo. It's okay. Majo, leí su mensaje, okay? I read your message. Ya leí su mensaje. No se preocupe. It's okay. Ahí sí. Si, si va a hacer algo, hágalo con confianza. Do it. Okay. Okay. Very good. So let's make groups of five then. We are going to make. Let me see. Well, hicieron dos razones, right? Two reasons. So, vamos a hacer equipo de tres entonces. Let's make groups of three. All right, let me see how many people I have connected. Five, five, five. Let me see, 15. Five groups. Cinco grupos. Five groups. Okay? Pueden, eh, como van, los equipos van a ser pequeños, the groups will be small. Pueden escribir dos razones por, por participante, okay? So, in this space, for example, Um, for example, on this space, you can write Javier, and here you can write Javier again. Aquí pueden escribir Javier nuevamente. Javier again, and you write the reasons, right? One reason for each space. Una razón para cada espacio, okay? One reason for each space. Okay? Agree? Any question? Or it's clear? Is it clear? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. all right. Uh, remember, vamos a ir a trabajar en equipos, pero no voy a andar visitando equipos. I want visit groups, ¿ok? Por eso pregunto si está claro ahorita. Si tienen alguna duda, pueden preguntar ahorita. Porque no voy a andar visitando equipos. I want visit groups. Solo me quedaré en uno. I will stay in one only. So, no questions? It's clear? Ok, let's go to working groups then. Vamos entonces a trabajar en equipos. Let's go to working groups.
Yeah, what are your acceptable reasons? And the product was defective. Okay. The product, the product was defective. Yes. The product was defect. Okay. Teacher, just one one reason per per person. Yeah, yeah, because we have uh, four members here. Mm -hmm. Okay. May, uh, you have basically you have uh, four spaces, right? Four spaces. So maybe one person can give uh two reasons okay and the others one and one mm -hmm. okay and well thank you and okay. what is your unacceptable reason carla uh, not have the purchase invoice not have the purchase invoice okay. Hello? Not have the personal invoice for the uh, purchase. Okay, the purchase invoice. Okay, thank you. And you, Lucy, uh, what is one acceptable reason? Yes, well, one of my acceptable reasons is uh, because the item is broke. Because? And the item is broke. It's broken. It's broken, so. Yeah, it's broken. It's okay, no problem. The, the item, item is, is broken. broken. Okay. And um, one of my uh, unacceptable reason is the product didn't match the description. The product is didn't match didn't match the description. When I buy when I was buy the product online maybe. Maybe. Description? Yes, didn't match the description. Okay. And Daniel, what is your acceptable reason? The products arrive back on time. The product arrive on time. Sí. Okay. And what is the unacceptable reason? The product is for quality. Poor quality. Yes. Javier, what is your acceptable reason? Okay. Uh, the wrong product. Okay. 
The wrong product. The wrong product. Yeah. It, this is a acceptable. Acceptable reason, yeah. Así wrong. se dice, teacher. Acceptable the or wrong unacceptable. No, acceptable. Acceptable. Mm. Mm. Equivocado, digamos. Yeah, yeah. The product uh -huh. is wrong. Maybe you can say the product is wrong. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. But th that is unacceptable, I think. No. Mm. Ese es no aceptable. It's unacceptable. Uh, that, that was, I think, in... <laughs> yes, yes. Be because, I mean, acceptable is that the product is right. Aceptable. No, okay. Okay. no aceptable es que el... El producto no, no es el correcto. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. okay. So the product <laughs> is wrong, you can say. Okay, entonces sería. Eh, quiero ver. Bueno, lo, el, el, el que di en, the wrong side en color. Por una. Talla equivocada y color. Mm -hmm. Ya, yeah, that's okay. For an acceptable. Mm -hmm. Entonces, sorry. The wrong side and color, acceptable reason. Oh no, it's it's but, okay. No, si that... está, sorry, sorry. No, si está bien, Javier. It's okay. I, I am confused. Yeah, it's okay, Javier, because it's an an acceptable reason to ask for a reason. Okay, una razón aceptable para pedir un reembolso. Y sí, el producto está equivocado es una razón aceptable. It's an accept it's an acceptable reason. It's okay. I'm sorry, Javier. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no problem. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Eh, falta una, ¿verdad? Un acceptable. Yes. Eh, sería the, the broken... The broken garment be user. The broken, the broken garment be used. Be user. Be user. User, user. Uh -huh. Usuario. User. Broken garment. Can you say it in Spanish, please? I, I have doubts about that. Eh, por, eh, sería por prenda, eh, ¿cómo lo podría decir? Mal manipulada. Por mala manipulación del producto, del, del usuario. Mm -hmm. Ah, but mm -hmm. I think that is, um, for example, the, main, celular, the, item, the item damage upon arrival, or cuando usted lo recibió, posiblemente se dañó. Un ejemplo. Ajá, una mala manipulación. Ajá, digamos. una mala manipulación. Ajá. But it's damage. Bad Pero use ya, ya of, maybe you can say uh -huh. maybe you can say a uh, bad use of the product by the customer bad mm -hmm. use of the product maybe all right mal uso del bad no, use okay. bad use of the of the product mal uso del producto bad, bad use of the product ah okay bad use of the product but by the user for <laughs> by the usuario. user exactly by the user Aunque si digo bad use, I, I am saying that is the, the, the user, all right? <laughs> yes. Porque se supone que ya lo tiene en mano, ¿verdad? El, el, el cliente, yes. right? Mm -hmm. So I don't need to say by the user. User miss. User miss. Y misuse eh, va a depender del contexto en que lo, lo puede utilizar uno. Which one? Eh, misuse. Misuse. In what in what context uh -huh. do you did you find it? Nah, digamos así como un, 
un mal uso, digamos. Uh -huh. eh, encontré esa palabra, sí, pero no. Yeah, no sé it's, si like to, it's like, yeah, I know. It's like to use something incorrectly. Uh -huh. Misuse of the product. You can use it. Se puede usar también misuse of the product. Misuse of mm -hmm. the product. Mm -hmm. It's ah, okay. okay. Yeah. So did you finish? Yes, I think yes. so. Yeah. All right, I hope everybody finished. finished. Okay, so let's go to the main session then. Okay. All right. Teacher. Tell me question about the the exam it today is the last day sí estaba a punto de decirle porque aquí la tengo en la lista de la que no he terminado ah ok no quiso yes. decirle frente a todo sí le falta el midterm el examen le falta el examen medio yes the, the part two part two is is missing ah ok so uh, completed, I already please. completed yes thank okay, you ok perfect thank you very much Okay, creo que faltan algunos que regresen. I think I have some people missing. Yeah, they're coming back. Están regresando. They're coming back. Teacher. Yeah. Podría permitirnos compartir la pantalla cuando estemos en los grupos. Yeah, sure, no problem. Por supuesto, of course. <laughs> Para la próxima. For the next. All right. Cuando cuando estén en 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 sesiones de en en grupos de en salas de grupos. Sí. Okay. Okay. Uh, recuérdenme antes de que vayamos a la sesión para activar la opción porque tengo que activarla cada vez que la necesita. Okay, you have to activate it every time you need it. Okay. Qué terrible okay. me dejaron hablando solo en el grupo. <laughs> I'm sorry. Teacher, ¿por qué será que no le escucho? Mm, creo que seguramente tiene problemas con el audio. Los demás me escuchan. The rest can listen to me. Yes. 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 Ok, very good. Bien, Revise las bien, opciones bien. de audio ahí, por favor, tal vez. Wendy. O tal vez la conexión es el problema. ¿Ahora me escucha, Wendy? No. No, I don't think so. Ok. Le vamos a escribir un mensajito entonces. Ya, 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 teacher. Ah, ok, ok. Very good. Ok, ah. Uh, Thank you very much for practicing. Now let's listen to, to four people, okay? Let's listen to four people saying all the reasons you have, the four acceptable and the four unacceptable reasons you have, all right? Volunteers, I need volunteers. You just need to read, solo necesitan ir. You just need to read the four acceptable reasons and the four unacceptable reasons, okay? Cristina, I, I think. Finished. Okay, let's listen to Cristina, please. <laughs> um, okay. You can say the name if you want, Cristina. For example, you can say, ¿Con quién practicó? Who did you practice with? Okay, con Héctor, Rafael y Santos. Okay, you can say, Héctor, acceptable reason, blah, blah, blah. Unacceptable reason, blah, blah, blah. And then the other name, y luego el otro nombre, and then you continue, okay? A ver, okay. Uh, vamos a ver. Permítame solo. It's okay. Okay, Santos doesn't warranty. Okay. Acceptable eh, or unacceptable? Acceptable reason or unacceptable reason? Acceptable reason. Okay, no warranty. Okay, continue. Ajá. Uh -huh. In a separate reason, the customer don't follow the instructions. All right. Continue. Okay, Rafael, acceptant reason, the product is broke in the travel. 
All right. Unacceptable reason. Customer request after worrying the ship in bank. All right. Hector, wrong product delivery. All right. Unicept reason, claim after warranty period. All right. Cristina, product with missing parts. Unicept, unicept. Unacceptable, unacceptable. <laughs> unacceptable reason. Customer me misuse damage. Okay, misuse. Mal uso del cliente, ¿cómo uh, misuse. sería? Misuse, misuse uh, of misuse. the client, maybe. Mm -hmm. Misuse, okay. of the, maybe you can say misuse of the product, misuse of the product, mal uso del, del producto, misuse the of product. the product. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, thank you. Uh, so you're missing one, or that's it? That's it all, that's it. Good evening, hello. Uh, oh. Cristina, you finished? Yes, right? Okay, thank you very much, Cristina. Yes. Carlos, you want to participate? Uh, I feel lost. <laughs> uh, no, no, va entrando ahorita. Yo sé que, que pidió yeah. permiso. I know you asked for permission. It's okay, don't worry. So another volunteer. I said three, three or four volunteers. So one more volunteer. One volunteer. Uh, me, Carla. Okay, let's listen to Carla Maria, please. Um, Lucy. Acceptable reason because the item is broken. All right. And Daniel, acceptable reason the product arrived on time. Okay. Javier, acceptable reason the product is wrong. Uh, me, Carla, the, the acceptable reason the product was defective. And Lucy, unacceptable reason the product didn't match the description. Daniel, the product is poor quality. Javier, bad use of the product by the user. And me, not have the purchase invoice. All right, very good. It's excellent. Uh, in the first one, the pronunciation is item, okay? Articulo, ah, item. item, item. For everybody, item. not only for Carla Maria, for everybody. Articulo is item, all right? The pronunciation. Thank you very much, Carla Maria. Very good. That's excellent. Uh, another volunteer. You only need to read, okay? You only need to read the reasons. That's it. So volunteers. Oh my goodness, it's so hard to find volunteers here. <laughs> No more volunteers? Do we continue with the next activity? No, no more volunteers. Okay, all right, no problem, it's okay. You only need to read it. Ah, Javier, I think, right? No, Rafa, le decía. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I don't know if he wants to, no sé si quiere hacerlo, Rafa. I don't know if Rafa wants to do it. What? Yeah. Do you want to share? Yeah, Santo, the customer did not follow the instruction. Okay. Uh, the customer can request a refund if the item arrives with a miss missing car missing part okay the customer cannot re request a refund after the pro warranty experience experience right. the client asked for a color and they send him another color all right the, the, the last one is unacceptable right? acceptable or unacceptable la uh -huh. última uh, and only in a first is acceptable. All right, acceptable. And a second, and a three is, is no. I know, I know acceptable. Unacceptable. All right. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much, Rafa. Thank you. That's excellent. Okay. All right. And thank you for your participations in this activity. Okay. Thank you very much. So uh, let me pass the attendance before we go to the next activity.
eh, se pudo trabajar en sesión de grupos, solo que no visité los grupos, okay? I didn't visit the groups, but I think it's okay. I, as long as you work with others, it's okay. Siempre y cuando trabaje con otros, creo que no hay problema, ¿verdad? I think there's no problem. Okay, let's see, Carlos. I am passing the attendance in this moment, okay? Carlos? Present, teacher. Cristina? Present. Espérense que este lápiz claro que tengo aquí no me quiere funcionar. Ok, yeah, it's working. Daniel? Present. Ok, that's amazing. Raquel? Ellen Eason? Elsie? Present, teacher. Hazel? Present, teacher. All right. Hector? Present teacher. Irma? Present teacher. Javier? I am here, teacher. Johnny? Present. Mauricio? <coughs> Lucy? Present. Majo? Present teacher. Okay. Rafa? I am here, teacher. Santos? Present, teacher. Ulises? Present, teacher. Wendy? I am here. Carla Maria? Present. And Carla Raquel? Present, teacher. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, solo antes de avanzar, eh, solo mencionar, bueno, Hazel eh, me debe trabajo de la plataforma y debían tenerlo listo hoy antes de la sesión. Así que, por favor, al final de la sesión, Hazel, si me está escuchando, tal vez se queda para que complete el trabajo de la plataforma, ¿ok? Ok, sí, sure. Eh, Mauricio no está conectado, ¿verdad? Eh, bueno, Majo creo, no sé si va a poder completar. Si puede, Majo lo hace, ¿ok? Porque yo sé la, I know the situation, ¿ok? ¿A Rafa? No, teacher, los, sorry. No, ajá, no, no, Majo, si, si, si tiene algún espacio, lo hace, si no, no hay, no hay problema, ok, luego solucionamos, ok. Teacher. Sí, Rafa. Sí, sí que yo me, me cambié el celular y no sé qué hice y no me puedo meter a la plataforma de, de, las, de los deberes, de las tareas, entonces sí. mañana, y, y ahí hizo un montón, hasta Javier, que más inteligente que mí, me quiso ayudar y no pudo. Este mañana la puedo hacer del celular de, de otro compañero, de Javier. Yes, me lo hubieran reportado para, 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 para ver qué hacíamos, ¿ok? No, sí, uh, sí, me... sí, siempre que se den cosas así, por favor, eh, repórtenos para, para ver qué se puede hacer, ¿ok? Le fíjese, mandó un mensaje. Fíjese, fíjese. Sí, Javier. Yes. Fíjese que como él cambió el teléfono, entonces se lo revisé. Cuando inicia sesión en la plataforma, le dice, eh, tú has iniciado sesión correctamente en Google, le dice, pero tu cuenta, le dice, no está asociada con inglés corporativo, le dice. Ese pero, tira el mensaje y, y arriba de ese tira a un error que dice que se ha bloqueado el usuario, que espere 30 minutos, dice. Correctamente. A veces hay que esperar hasta 24 horas incluso, ¿ok? Eh, lo primero que hay que hacer es estar seguro de que el correo que está utilizando es el que proveyó a, a, a inglés corporativo. Porque si está tratando de usar otro correo, nunca va a poder entrar. Entonces, asegúrense de que el correo está correcto, porque si hay una letra o algo equivocado en el correo, no van a poder entrar. Okay, you won't enter. Eso es lo primero. Okay. Y si aún así el problema persiste, esperen lo, el tiempo que les dice, intenten nuevamente. Y si no le funciona, mañana me escribe Rafa, por favor, para reportarlo, ¿ok? Ok, sí, porque yo solo eso, este, esto, eh, no sé qué, yo no soy muy tecnológico. Entonces, no, no. Para eso soy bien pasado. Sí. Y entonces, no sé qué no hice, problema. pero sí. Yo mañana le, le, le escribo a su personal y, y, y puedo ver qué hago, oiga. Ok, perfecto. Si el problema persiste, entonces ahí me escribe, por favor. Eh, Santos, eh, le falta el midterm. Santos, hello. Le falta, no, el, teacher. Midterm. Le falta el midterm, ¿verdad? El examen medio. Eh, no, teacher, ya lo mandé. Ahorita, durante la, durante la sesión o antes. No, lo mandé ahora por la tarde. 
Ok, ya voy a revisar, tal vez no actualizó. Bueno, prácticamente sí, eh, ellos. Las... Sí, hoy por la tarde lo mandé. Ok, voy a revisar otra vez. Me mandé entonces, dos, tal vez. Dos, dos, tareas, dos tareas que me faltaban y el, y, y el examen. Ok, muy bien. Voy a revisar entonces. Okay. Eh, disculpen que les diga así, pero este, si no los agarro aquí, ya después se está escribiendo cada uno, está bastante difícil. Ok. Eh, muy bien, let's continue then, let's continue with the class then. Continuemos con la clase entonces, let's continue with the class. All right, let's see the next activity. Uh, in the next activity, so basically today, what we are doing is reviewing, right? Lo que estamos haciendo hoy es repasar lo que ya hemos visto. So this is uh, the last class of the week. It's basically practice, okay? It's practice, it's practice, it's practice. Okay, so let's go then to the next activity. And here on page 28, okay? we have some questions, right? So the idea is that you read the description. All right, this is the description. Um, and write down the correct demonstrative pronoun. This is the description, okay? So read the descriptions, all right? And on the space, on the space provided, write the correct demonstrative pronoun. This, that, these, or those, all right? It depends on the description, dependiendo de la descripción, depending on the description. Let's do number one together. Hagamos el número uno juntos. How could you buy something like talking about a purse in your hand, hablando de una cartera en tu mano? So what is correct? How could you buy something like? This. This, this right? So it's the singular, like this. So the answer here is, this all right yeah okay continue with the others continue con los demás. continue with the others so you need to go, you need to use this that these for those right don't forget to check the description in parentheses okay don't forget to check the description in parentheses please Just remember that this and these es para algo que está cerca, for something that is close, o algo que estoy tocando. Y for el that y el those es para algo que está más lejos. Something is far, okay? Remember that, please.
Uh, the same, when you finish, uh, please go to reactions and raise your hands, all right? When you finish, please go to reactions and raise your hands, please. So I have a record of the people who have finished. Okay, thank you, Javier and Lucy. Okay, only Javier and Lucy have finished. Okay, let's wait, Javier and Lucy. Let's be patient. All right, he's finished. Thank you. Rafa too, thank you very much. Don't lower your hands. All right, no bajen la mano, así dejen. Keep your hands like that. Okay, thank you, Rafa. Okay, thank you, Carla. Carla Raquel. <laughs> no bajen la mano, don't lower your hands. Okay, I'll give you one more minute, okay? Un minuto más, one more minute to finish. And then we check.
Okay. <clears throat> okay, uh, let's see what you have. Uh, so please, uh, we are going to uh, share the answers as a class, okay? Vamos a compartir todos. We are going to share together. So please, at the moment you give the answer, activate your microphone, okay? Al momento de dar la respuesta, activan su micrófono solo para dar la respuesta, okay? Just to give the answer, okay? Uh, so number one, the answer is this, right? How could you buy something like this, all right? Number two, what do you have in number two, everybody? ¿Qué tienen la voz? What do you have in number two? What those? In number oh. two, what do you, those? And, and the others, y los demás? These, teacher. These. These. these, okay, you have these, all right. Yes, these. the answer, the answer for this one is these, in plural, all right? These, in plural, all right? Let me write it here, these. In plural, right? Yes. These. So the answer is these reports are very heavy, all right? These reports are very heavy. Let's see number three. I had to wear, what do you have here? These. Those. Those, all right? Yes, the answer is those, all right? I had to wear those comfortable shoes I bought, all right? Yo tuve que usar esos zapatos cómodos que compré. I had to wear those comfortable shoes I bought. Okay, let's see number four. What do you have in number four? That. That, what? exactly. So the answer for number four is that is correct. Okay, that. Uh, what do you have in number five? Is. This. This. These. These. But it says here, look, about a picture hanging on the wall. That is the description. Esa es la descripción. Acerca de una foto colgada en la pared. So is that, this or those? That. 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 But it's is plural. Children. Plural. It's plural. It's children. So is that or those? These. No, no. But listen, listen. About a picture hanging on the wall. Acerca de una fotografía colgada en la pared. ¿Está cerca? Is it close? No, no, no estoy tocando la fotografía. I'm not touching the, 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 the picture. So the answer is those. Okay. Those are Mr. Pineda's children. Esos son los hijos de el señor Pineda. Okay. Those are Mr. Pineda's children. ¿Por qué uso those? Porque la descripción dice que la foto está colgada en la pared. No está cerca, no le estoy tocando, ¿ok? I'm not touching it, ¿ya? Yeah? ¿De acuerdo? Right? Yes, right. Sí. Ok, let's see number, number six. What do you have in number six? This. This. Look at the description. About a picture hanging on the wall. Acerca de una foto colgada ya en la pared. Okay, there on the wall. That. So you say, this or that? That. That, that yeah. exactly. That picture you see, my wife. In that picture you see my wife and daughter. So it's that. ¿Por qué uso that? Porque la foto no la estoy tocando. Y dijimos que el that es cuando algo está un poquito más lejos, ¿verdad? ¿Ya? Yeah? Y si la foto está colgada en la pared, obviamente no la estoy tocando, right? I'm not touching it. Yeah, so I say that. That picture you see... In that picture, you see my wife and daughter, okay? Yeah. So if you don't have it like this, please correct. Si no lo tienen así, corrijan. Correct, please. Okay? Ready? Done? Yes. Okay. Let's go to uh, the next activity for today. So listen, in the next activity, uh, we have, it says, complete the different questions and then ask a partner and write the answer. So please, in this moment, complete the questions with the information you want. Okay, vamos a completar con la información que quieran, with the information you want. For example, uh, I can say, what can you? What can you what? What can I say here? ¿Qué puedo decir aquí? What can, what can I say here? What can you, ¿qué puedes tú? What can you what? What can you? Make the homework. Mm -hmm. What can you make the homework? ¿Qué puedes hacer la tarea? What can you... No, uh, tell me another compliment. 
Mm. ¿Qué puedes hacer maybe, hoy, tal vez? What can Sorry? you or maybe what can you what can you to buy with this money? All right, that's better. Okay, what can you buy with this money? It's correct. Okay, ¿qué puedes comprar con ese dinero? What can you buy with this money? All right, and then you continue with this money with uh, this um, money, for example. Okay, ¿qué puedes comprar con ese dinero? What can you buy with this money? Okay, good. Only write the questions, please. Solo escriban las preguntas. Only write the questions, okay? So continue with the rest of the questions. Continue con las demás. Continue with the rest. Number two is when could you? ¿Cuándo podrías tú? When could you come, for example? Where can you? Where can you buy a car? Okay. How could you? How could you um, fix this car? Or how could you fix this printer? ¿Cómo podría, podrías tú arreglar esta impresora? How could you fix this printer? Who can you visit today? ¿A quién puedes visitar hoy? Who can you visit today? Why could you? ¿Por qué podrías tú? All right. So please complete the questions. Only the questions, okay? Solo las preguntas vamos a hacer. Only the questions. Uh, you can put any compliment you want, okay? It's personal, it's optional, all right? 
you are not like tied to use something specific. No, you can use any information you want. Pueden usar la información que quieran. You can use the information you want, okay? To complete the questions. Teacher, I have a question. Yes, and tell the me. Number, the number four is how call how call you? Eh, sería como pudiste, sería. O, no, podrías. No. Ah, como podrías. Como podrías tú. Yes. Ah, como podrías tú. Yes, that's ah, right. Thank you. All right, no problem. Para todas sería podría. The meaning in this case of could is podría because that's the context we have been studying, okay? In ese contexto hemos estado estudiando el could, okay? Podría. Okay. Uh, when oh. can you? Cuando podrías? For example, uh -huh. cuando podría venir? When could you come, all right? For a future purpose, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The ah, same okay. for the last one. Lo mismo para la última. Why could you? ¿Por qué podrías tú? Why could you? All right. Ah, okay. Okay, thank you. All right, no problem. Teacher, have a question. Tell me. Um, before called you, I need you to. And no. no, 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 not necessary. As you can see, uh, as you can see here, I said, uh, what can you buy? The same, okay. when could you buy? I don't say to buy, right? No, it's not necessary. Okay, okay. Yeah. Thank you. All right, no problem.
saying, please let me know when you finish by raising your hand, okay? Let me know when you finish by raising your hand, please, all right? Déjenme saber cuando terminen a través de levantar su mano, please. So let me know, please, by raising your hand. This is very important for me because when I go to the next activity, uh, I have to make sure the majority has finished, okay? Tengo que asegurarme que la mayoría ha terminado. I have to make sure the majority has finished, okay? So this is very important for me. So Christina, have you finished? Yes, right? Yes, okay, excellent. Thank you for raising your hands. Oh, Carla Maria, thank you for raising your hands too. Thank you, Javier, for raising your hands too. Thank you, Hector. <laughs> Thank you, Johnny and Ulysses. Thank you very much. Thank you, Carla Raquel. Thank you, Lucy. Okay, two more minutes. Dos minutos más, two more minutes. All right, time is over. Uh, I'm sorry, time is over. Uh, so listen, uh, in this moment you have the questions, right? Well, almost everybody, casi todos, almost everybody has the questions. So the idea in this moment is to ask the questions to a classmate, okay? So you will work in pairs. And when you ask the questions, take notes about the answers, okay? For example, imagine I practice with Javier. Imagine I practice with Javier. So Javier, can you ask me question number one? Me puede hacer la primera pregunta. Can you ask me question number one? Okay. Uh, what can you buy with this money? Um, I can buy coffee. So Javier has to write, I can buy coffee. He has to write my answer. Tiene que escribir mi respuesta, okay? I can buy coffee. So 
but don't write it, Javier. It's not even an example, all right? So let's <laughs> ejemplo. You will practice with a classmate in a moment, okay? In a moment, you'll practice with a classmate. So can you ask me question okay. number two to have another example? Question number two. Javier. Okay. Uh, when could you come home? Um, I could come home tomorrow. So Javier writes, I could come home tomorrow, okay? So, le preguntan a su compañero y escriben la respuesta que ellos le den. And you write the answers, okay? Is it clear? Yeah? Yeah. So take turns, okay? Uh, si Javier me pregunta, luego yo le pregunto. Then I ask him, all right? Yeah? O van una pregunta y una pregunta cada uno, one and one, all right? So he asked me question number one, and then I ask him my question because my question is different. Okay, porque mi pregunta es diferente. Yo le hago la pregunta y tomo notas. Para que vayan así. Mejor una pregunta cada uno. Okay, one question each. All right. Is it clear? ¿Estamos claros? Is it clear? Les pregunto si está claro porque no voy a poder visitarlos a, así en, en los grupos. Okay, I, I won't be able to visit you. So is it clear? Yeah? Yes, teacher. Yeah? Okay, perfect. So let's go then, work in pairs, and please take notes about the answers, okay? Ask equations and take notes. All right, let's go. So you will work in pairs. Uh, just, solo quiero asegurarme si van a trabajar los que tienen cámara apagada. Wendy? Yes? Yes, right? ¿Va a trabajar en actividad? Yes, teacher. Yes. Mauricio? Es para hacer las parejas de acuerdo a las personas que tenemos, okay? No, teacher. Okay. Ah, uh, Elsie? No, pues manejando. Okay, no problem. Yes, yes, right, yes, yes. Hazel? Está sin audio, dice. Pero va a trabajar. Hay <laughs> un mensajito ahí, por favor. Uh, me quedé sin partir. Okay, yeah. Uh, Doris, Raquel, va a participar. Will you participate in the activity? Uh, no, teacher, no. Okay, okay. Yeah. So let me see then. I have uh, 15. 16 people connected. So we are going to make eight pairs. Vamos a hacer entonces ocho parejas. Let's make eight pairs. Okay. Y los que no van a trabajar, por favor, no entren a las sesiones. Así para ir viendo más o menos. Okay. A las sesiones de, 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 de grupos. A las salas de grupos. Okay. Eight groups, I said, right? Okay, let's go. Tenemos 10 minutos para esto. We have 10 minutes for this. I can buy juice. I can buy juice. This juice, uh huh. In your answer. What is? Sería, I can buy teacher. I can buy teacher. Teacher. Uh, yo puedo comprar una camiseta. Ah, teacher. Uh -huh. <laughs> teacher. <laughs> teacher. Okay. Number two, when could you 
Ah, ok. The second is when could you check the emails that send you? Do you understand? When could you check the emails that send you? O sea, ¿cuándo podrías chequear los correos que te envío? Pero poner. Eso quise poner. Okay. Your answer. I could. I could check tomorrow. Yep. Yeah, check them, creo. Ah. Huh? I creería que podría ser I could check them. Yeah, it's correct. I could check them tomorrow because you are tomorrow. talking about the emails, okay? I could check them tomorrow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're right, you're right, Carlos. Okay. okay. Yeah. Number two, Daniel. When could you help me with the homework? Could you? No, when could you? When could you help me with the homework? Oh. Uh, could you? I, I could, I could help. I, I could help you. I could help you tomorrow. Okay. Number three. Uh, where where can you go by this medicine? Where it's correct, teacher. I think you better say, where can you buy this medicine? You don't have to say go. Only where can you buy this medicine? Where can you buy? Okay. Yeah. Donde puedes comprar esa medicina? Where can you buy this medicine? Where can you buy? Okay. Where can you buy this medicine? Yeah. I can buy them. What the pharmacy? Pharmacy. At the pharmacy. Pharmacy. I could pharmacy. buy it at the pharmacy. You can say, Daniel, I could buy it at the pharmacy. Pharmacy. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, okay. Question. Where can you play soccer? I <laughs> I can I can play soccer uh, Saturday in the morning. But it's where I think. Where or where or when, Daniel? Where? Where? Ah, where? It's where. where? Yeah, where? I I can I can play this okay in my my neighborhood. In? I can I can play soccer. In my neighborhood, in my vecindario. Ah, okay. <laughs> Teacher, is correct the question? Yeah, it's okay. Uh, the number four. Ah, okay, really? How 
how could you tell me that I leave you alone? Can you repeat, please? O sea, lo que quiero poner es, ¿cuándo podrías decirme, cómo podrías decirme que te deje solo? No. How could you tell me uh, to leave you alone? To leave you alone. How could you tell me to leave you alone? Could you tell me to leave you alone? Y... But they tell me to leave you alone. How could you tell me to leave you alone? Yeah. Como puede decirme que te deje solo. Yes. Leave you alone. Yeah. Difficult. <laughs> ah, porque me duele la cabeza. <laughs> I have working. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> And you? How could you cook the rice? Ah. Uh, right. Uh, I I can't I can't cook the rice. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that, question is, that question is very difficult because you need to explain the recipe, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, the other is who can help with that money? What? What? Lo que, quiero, lo que quiero poner es eh, a quién puedes ayudar con ese dinero. Who can you help with that money? It's correct. Yeah, it's, it's okay. It's perfect. Okay. I can help the people tour. Poor people. Poor people. Yeah. Sorry. People. Or you can say people in need. Gente que tiene necesidad. People in need. People. Uh, yeah. You can say that too. Answer your question. Who can you close the door? This meeting is being recorded. Okay, everyone. Can you listen to me? Yes. Can you hear me? I think so. Yes. You can hear me or you can't. You can or you can't. <laughs> I can. You can hear me. Yes. Me escuchan, verdad? Can you hear me? Yes, right? All right. Ok, everyone, well, um, yo sé que, bueno, no sé, ¿quiénes terminaron? O ninguno terminó, nobody finished. Nobody, right? It's ok, don't worry, no se preocupen. Eh, por aquí escribirlos con quién trabajaron, aquí tengo las parejas, I have the pairs here, don't worry, ok? So we finish tomorrow, para que terminemos mañana, les daré unos 5 o 10 minutos para que termine, for you to finish, ok? It's ok, no se preocupen si no terminaron, don't worry if you didn't finish, pero no quiero dejarlos muy tarde, por supuesto, ok? I don't, want, I don't want to let you go late. Solo paso asistencia y nos vamos. Los que no han terminado plataforma, sí se me quedan y me la terminan, por favor, ¿ok? Eso sí, les va, le va a tocar quedarse otro momento. Ustedes saben quiénes son los que no han terminado, ¿ok? Uh, let me pass the attendance. Carlos. Present. Ok, hold on.
Christina? Present. Daniel? Present. Doris Raquel? Present. Ellen Ilson? Present, teacher. Kelsey? Present, teacher. Hazel? Héctor? Present, teacher. Irma? Present, teacher. Javier? Present, teacher. Johnny? Present. Mauricio? Present, teacher. Lucy? Ma eh, Mauricio, Present. antes de que vaya, de que continúe, no me ha terminado plataforma, ¿verdad, Mauricio? No, teacher. Ok. Eh, eh, bueno, en una hora espero poderlo terminar, teacher. Ok, sí, por favor, no please. Terminar. Ok, por sí. favor, please. Okay. María José Majo, o oh, dijo que se desconectaba porque tenía problemas, creo yo. No sé si se conectó nuevamente. Uh, Rafael. Santos. Present teacher. Ulises. Teacher. Present teacher. Wendy. I am here, teacher. Jessica. Oh, well, she's not connecting anymore. Carla María. Present. And Carla Raquel. Present teacher. Ok, very good. Muy bien. Eh, bueno, solo decirles que para evitar, por ejemplo, que, que estén trabajando a última hora, que siempre lleven al día el trabajo de la plataforma, ¿ok? Porque si no, después se nos acumula y a última hora estamos como queriendo avanzar, ¿ok? Así que la, la, la idea es que vayan trabajando día a día en la plataforma. Así que para, para la siguiente sección, para que no se les acumule, traten de ir avanzando día a día para que así el último día ya no tengan ningún problema, ya lo tienen casi todo terminado, ¿ok? Yo sé que si toman unos 5 o 10 minutos al día pueden hacerlo rápidamente, ¿ok? Que los ejercicios no son tan complicados. A veces quedan errores, pero eso, se, eso es otra cosa, ¿verdad? Pero les, lo, para completar los ejercicios no, demo, no se demoran mucho tiempo, ¿ok? Eh, bueno, solo para la sesión de hoy uno a uno, ¿a quién le corresponde? Who is today? Who's turn is today? Yes, Irma, ¿verdad? A Irma le corresponde ese día. Ayer estuvo Héctor, ¿verdad? Si no me equivoco, ¿sí? Yes, teacher. Ok, muy bien. Irma, entonces, para ese día. Ok, everybody. Well, thank you very much for connecting today. You can go. You are free. Good night and see you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Buenas noches y les veo mañana. Bye. 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 See you, everyone. Teacher, just a question. Yes, tell me. I want to be secure if you receive the my homework my exam okay text me please text me to my whatsapp okay ya voy a revisar porque ahorita debo atender ahí so text me please okay, right. gracias no problem it's okay text me on whatsapp okay irma this space is for you este espacio es para usted como siempre una vez cada una vez al módulo pero tienen este espacio verdad <ríe> así que adelante sí. Pues el único problema que ahorita tengo es que no he terminado también el, el, las tareas. Creo que me faltan dos a medias porque en el, en el que tenían todos problemas, la número cinco es la que no me deja pasar a mí. La pregunta cinco. Uh -huh. Entonces tengo que seguir intentando ahí que no sé por qué será. Porque... Si quiere intentemos ahorita, hagamos una cosa. ¿Tiene abierta la plataforma? Eh, sí, quiero ver. Creo que lo saqué. ¿Está trabajando en computadora ahorita o en teléfono? En computadora. Vaya, eh, abra un documento Word y hace lo que dijo Carla María, a ver si le funciona. ¿Qué número es, me dijo? Es, la, es en el examen, la pregunta 5. Voy a revisar ahorita. Creo que me, yo creo que me salté la... No, ¿cómo se llaman los ejercicios? Quiero ver. El examen. En el examen es que tiene problemas. Sí, digamos. Sí, en el examen. ¿En qué, en qué, en qué parte es del examen específicamente? 
ahorita de lo que es. Ya Tiene me cuatro partes el examen, si no me equivoco, ¿verdad? Ah, ah, yo creo que por eso es que me he equivocado, porque veo que es un montón. Sí, son cuatro partes, correctamente. Ajá, Ajá déjeme ver, solo para ver. Sí, cuatro partes son. No sé en qué parte es que se ha confundido. Ahorita veo. Era en la, en la, en cuatro, la nueve. Va, en... Pero en la... Vaya, es que el examen tiene cuatro partes. Parte uno, parte dos, parte tres y parte cuatro. No sé en qué oh, parte que se ha confundido. En la parte dos, creo que. La parte dos. Revise la parte dos del examen. Es donde está la indicación. Dice, choose the correct noun. Elige el nombre correcto. Y es una... Esa es de opción Ajá. múltiple. Sí, la... La parte 2 en, en el ejercicio 9, la pregunta 5, donde dice They could like to. No, no, entonces no es el examen. Estamos en, entonces en la sección. Si es la parte 9, es en la sección, no es en el examen. Porque el examen solo tiene parte 1, parte 2, parte 3 y parte 4. Uh -huh. Y cada una trae 5 preguntas, cada parte. Entonces sería en el. Déjeme, déjeme ir. En la tarea 9. En la tarea 9, correctamente. Ajá, va, déjeme ir entonces. Sí, porque estaba en el examen ahorita revisando. Sería entonces, no sería en el examen, sería en la tarea, en las tareas de la semana. Uh -huh. Déjeme ver. Sería en la tarea 9, ¿verdad? Sí. Sí, exactamente. ¿En qué número? Es que en tuvo la problema. 5. ¿En la? En la 5. Yo le en puse de de igual like to come, ah, que así nos mandaron también los compañeros Ajá. Y, y no no me deja pasar revisé que tenga mayúsculas eh, puntos el, el apóstrofe a ver. déjeme ver ahorita lo voy a pegar así como me dijo en Word pero vale, le voy a ajá, se lo se lo voy a se lo voy a mandar al WhatsApp y solo lo copia y lo pega a ver si le funciona Ah, ok. Oh, pero no tengo abierto el WhatsApp aquí. <ríe> ok. A ver si podemos hacer algo. Solo en esa tiene problema, ¿verdad? Solo en la número 5. Y la otra que me faltan que completarlas porque no me dio tiempo de terminar. Ah, ok, pero esta es que no las ha terminado. Okay. Sí. Bueno, déjeme, déjeme abrir el WhatsApp entonces ahorita. No lo tenía abierto WhatsApp. Bueno. Mándeme un mensajito al WhatsApp para contestarle ahí, mandarle la respuesta, por favor. Ahorita. Skype. Lo otro es que igual yo en el teléfono no puedo abrir este, la, la aplicación para las tareas, solo en la computadora. Mm. O sea, ya tengo el link, pero no, no me deja abrir. Ajá, este, ¿se ¿está segura que entra con el correo correcto? Con el correo electrónico correcto. Y en la clave es 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Sí. Mm. Pero ¿Puede... quizás quizás lo estaba haciendo muy a la carrera, me equivoqué tal vez. Ah, sí. Ahí le mandé un mensaje. Ok, ahorita estoy cargando el WhatsApp en mi computadora que veo que no me quiere cargar. Vale, le voy a mandar una respuesta ahorita, así es, a ver si le funciona. Está bien. Okay, y la copia y la pega nada más de ahí de, del WhatsApp, a ver, tal vez le funciona con esa respuesta, ¿ok? Solo copia y pega del WhatsApp. Puede copiar y pegar del WhatsApp, ¿verdad? Ahorita voy a probar. Ok. Así como está, solo la copia y la pega. A ver si uh -huh. le funciona. Intente, por favor. Try, please. Sí, ahorita no me da la opción de copiar. Ay. Copiar. ¿En la computadora está usando el WhatsApp? Sí, pero ya, que... ya me dio. 
Ah, ok. Tiene que seleccionar el texto que no, le, que no vea ningún espacio más cuando lo pegue, ok. Uh -huh. vale, vamos a ver. Veamos. Y me dice ya. si le funciona. Sí, sí funcionó. Ah, ok. Perfecto. Ahí está sí. solucionado entonces el problema. <risa> sí. Ya, sí. Sí, este, lo que puede hacer es lo que dijo Carla María. Resolverlo uh -huh. en un documento de Word aparte y después copiar y pegar la respuesta. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Creo que sería lo más conveniente porque esa es la opción que le funcionó a ella. Me imagino que sí. tiene que funcionar para todos. Sí, porque acaba de funcionar también. Y había, y ya había escrito esa respuesta, me imagino. Sí, era la que habían mandado en el, ¿En el grupo. Ah, no me fijé si era el mismo. Ah, ah. No okay. me fijé si era la misma respuesta, pero si sí era la que habían mandado en el grupo. Ok, lo más importante es que ya se ha resuelto. Sí, dicho otra cosa que le iba a decir que el día de mañana. Eh, Voy a faltar porque tengo un compromiso familiar y, y creo que no me voy a poder conectar. Pero si vengo a tiempo, yo me conecto. Okay. O si no, tal vez voy a estar como de oyente. Okay. Como les repito, yo no les puedo autorizar. Sí, okay, no, sí, eh, sí me, me informan, ¿verdad? Está bien, uh -huh. ¿ok? Pero no puedo decir si sí, doy permiso, no doy permiso, como les expliqué al principio, porque no estoy autorizado. Pero, sí, yo thank you. Gracias por informar, ¿ok? Thank you for informing. Ok, teacher. Ok. Bueno, good night, entonces. Okay, good night and see you, well, tomorrow or Monday, I don't know. <laughs> sí. Okay. Goodbye. Okay, bye. Bye. Bye, bye. Thank <clears throat> you.